Hello, hello! Welcome to another part of my um, Pyfu review series. This is gonna be the third video featuring um, my weekly games at the Seattle Weekly League. And um, it's playing under WRC rule again, um, 30k. No Aka, um, no Aka Doras. So let's get started. Today I want to be focusing on how to um, play from behind because this is not a very uh, flowful game for me, I say. As um, I'll just skip ahead the first few rounds for you guys. Uh, as we go ahead, come try to clear his Richie here, and um, yeah, we'll go on phone mode here into uh, you know, a Hanuman dealer small. You hate to see that on um, East One at any given stage. You know, like East One dealer small means like pretty much it's very hard to take first place from here. So. Again, um, move on from here. Call and um, I declare Richie here with door three. Um, again. No. <laughs> Actually, if we go back, um, uh, yeah, I got rolled on the last tile, which is a two ping. It's very unfortunate, <laughs> but yeah, not much we can do. It's not even considered as a mistake because I mean, you Richie with three doors. It's 99.9% not a mistake. Um, let's move on. Again, um, hold the Dora with Tanki on it. Uh, we don't declare Richie on the last um, Jigoku Tanki. And the dealer draws into another uh, concealed hand. Uh, was that Dama Ping Fu? This stage we're like, yeah, we're not doing so hot. And again, we try to fight for, for another hand. Shimocha declares Richie. Yeah, getting Sumo down. I'm into a Mangan hand. Into a East 2. And we, again, we, we, we're, yeah, yeah, like we're not discouraged here. Mind you, we're, we declare Richie. We try to fight for a hand, even though this is a Kanchan. Um, definitely, at, at, like, at, at the middle of the second row, I'm not going to wait for another Tao improve my hand even though I draw the three ping but again against uh, Shimocha's Richie and I'm the dealer so and the Shimocha rolls on my Tao once again on the Kanchan weight um yeah so this brings us to um the East 3 where I'm actually gonna be trying to play it out you know unlucky turn of events I say because once you reach you cannot control which Tao you're gonna discard even though I did decide to challenge Shimocha's um Richie just didn't work in my favor. So again, we try for another hand. Here's where we decide what we're gonna wait on. Okay, so we drew the six. So we know there's a potential Novetan here, as well as a, a Liangmen chance here. Pretty much standard discard. Here I like to talk a little bit about efficiency. Um, it does look like a bad shape waiting on the Samsoul, but, um, yeah, you, you, you definitely want to declare Richie on this one. Because, again, in the middle, in the middle of the second row, uh, a lot of time you cannot afford to wait for the 4 or the 5 soul to improve into the Itsu here. So I just decided to Richie. Also because I'm really behind. So if I don't fight for a hand right here, right now, chances are I'm going to be really even more behind as the round goes. And uh, it's going to be very hard for me to come back, so. No. Alright, let's go back there for a bit. Because because of Richie, the, um, the natural Suji came down. More so from both of us. Um, Shimocha and me. So, Tayman was thinking probably the Suji was safe. And in fact, we'll take a look. So, uh, Tayman had no other safe tiles. So, yeah. So, he had to discard the Suji. This is why I believe uh, Kanchan and Penchan are such powerful weights because uh, you can always draw into a um, natural like Suji bait like whether you set it intentionally or not and yeah people will discard them and also you can summon them don't underestimate um, Kanchan or Penchan like Lamin is a great weight but sometimes it is very overrated and um, certainly believe in your Kanchans and Penchans that's a message I'm trying to deliver here Again, um, we're gonna go ahead with this one. Fairly standard discard with a summon. Okay. Drew the 8 soul here. 
aping. So we get the Liang Khan shape for the two four soul as well as Liang Man. We lose a Shampong, but Liang Khan is certainly a little stronger. And I can also improve the shape potentially. Here I draw the five soul. I have I have a choice between tossing the five soul and eight soul. But as you see, um, I'm gonna set this up. So I'm gonna discard the five soul here, and keeping my hand weight the same. By the way, discarding eight soul will not change um, your weights as well. It's still a Liang Khan either way. And I also discard the one soul in favor of uh, keeping the Liang Khan shape because Liang Khan shape we can guarantee keep the the keep on the Dora's Sanzo here. Instead of uh, drawing like a 4 ping and a 1 soul and discarding the Sanzo into Tenpai. Go ahead and do that. We draw the we draw into Tenpai here. So what we want to do here is we're thinking do I want to wait on the two soul, which is actually the indicator. So um or do we want to wait on a four soul? I decided to uh, reach it on a five soul. Reason being that I have a very good Suji trap set earlier on the five soul discard. And uh, discard five soul again. Uh, usually, uh, the the Suji to a uh, Richie decoration tile is a little dangerous, but since I discarded five soul again like a little earlier, so they might consider that two soul is safe against me, even though there's like two of them left. So, as you'll see later, a uh, Kamicha again. Kamicha, Kamicha is thinking that oh he discarded five soul earlier, so the chances of him waiting on the um, Nankan. The Liang Khan shape, the 135, discarding 5, waiting on a 2 soul, is a little lower. So he decided to take the risk, pushing 2 soul. And that's exactly what I was aiming at. So, again, the power of um, Suji Bait, and all, as well as Kan Chang Wei coming through this one. So we actually push um, against uh, Bait here, and successfully managed to take uh, third place at South 1. We'll see here. Um, Following is just again I'm trying to push a hand. Being very aggressive with a double call. Waiting for six nine soul. I draw it. So yeah, just us trying to come back into this game. Pushing very hard for our hand. Mm. So yeah, two norths are out and at this point I decided I wanna hold the east. Because stacking on the east will make this hand a lot easier to play. But since um, north was discarded, and uh, too many, I have too many pairs in my hand, so I just discard uh, discard north in order to transition to better blocks in my hand. I don't actually have five blocks in my hand, but because north is not a block I can improve. Like let's say if I draw a Faisal here, then I can easily build a block around Faisal. Just discard East. At this point, I know there's also a Kancha on the 5 pin here. Mm, the consideration here would be actually to cut the Faisal over the East. Because I know I have uh, 5 blocks built. And um, this is a stage where um, tiles are starting looking a little dangerous. Let me close up the hand again. So tiles are looking a little dangerous. And the only consideration to keep the Faisal right now is to uh, have a better door acceptance, which is the Forceal here. Let's move on and uh, discard. Also, you realize I'm skipping a little faster than the previous videos. I want to keep the video a little shorter so people don't have to sit there for 30 minutes. But yeah, well, we discard a 5 soul. We get punished just slightly with a 7 soul. But we can take it. And a Dama from Kamicha again. Kamicha only needs like cheap hands in order to secure his victory here. So with a 55k. So a whole lot of a 30k lead over everybody else. Mm, at this stage, yeah, I'm, I think I'm pretty much trying to go hashtag not last. As we hit out three. Cut the white first. I see enough um, blocks to build my hand without the Yakuhai. And I think I'm going for a Richie. So whatever you think you're going to go for a Richie instead of Yakuhai Palm, you should always discard the Yakuhai first. Versus uh, wanting to stack it and just like call Yakuhai and go for a one hand. So that would be the consideration there to cut Yakuhai first or cut um, like the weaker block like the one two first. In this case, I really need the one two because that's my fifth block to complete my hand. Discard the one. Here's the thing, I drew I drew the the Sanzo here the three and decided to discard the one. 
I wanted to greet for Dora acceptance, but perhaps putting the Sanzo here and just value the speed a little more will be a rational choice, as you'll see later. So since we cut the one, we cut the two. Keep a uh, safe tile, my friend, and we draw the three. Very unfortunate. Uh, I think this is something I could work on personally is to value the one two pen channel a lot more. Because yeah, again, as I said earlier, the um, pen channel and content ways are actually pretty good. Into mid game and late game, that you don't cut them. That one I know for sure. It's just that it was a turn four, it was early enough. So I consider that to be uh, a little reasonable in terms of cutting my blocks away. Yeah, unfortunately, um, as you see, we drew this back. So we're like, okay, what do we cut now? It will be e either because of one three will be another block. So now we have enough blocks to complete our hand. So I decided to cut the seven ping. So right now it will be a one four ping weight and a five soul weight here, as well as a two soul, of course, into tenpai. We drew the two ping, and yeah, again, this is getting to a later stage now. Now that Tame has a Tedashi the the two soul, as you as you get, can see. Mm. Really want to be cutting a little safer, so I cut the one soul. I think the one soul and uh, the Sanzo here is a lot safer compared to cutting the middle Pingzu. I, or I could just smoke it to ping, no problem as well. Formon. Formon. Slightly questionable, I say. Could be um, cutting the two ping or the Sanzo here. In fact, now I think about it, sorry, let's go back for a bit. Perhaps 2 ping will be a better cut here because I have to go down to cut. And it was discarded by my Kamicha three turns ago. Chances are, is the, um, Tim is not waiting on a 2 ping because I do have the 3 ping 1 chance in my hand. So there's that as a consideration. But the four, the four man, so four man definitely a little questionable in my opinion. So that's something I could be reflecting on. So now I see the the sun's all coming down. So I probably okay, okay, AP is still safe. So yeah, now that Tayman has cheat uh, pwned and discarded another tile, I know for a fact that probably Tayman is high. So now I discarded three, three the sun's all for sure. Yeah, yeah, that would be the thought process. I drew 7, so I'll probably discard the 2. Discard the 5. That's not right. That's not right, Oracle. Again, um, I'm also learning from my own mistake. So, I think I discarded a Faisal at the time because of uh, Nakasuji to both Kamicha and uh, Taemin. But the consideration would be that 2 ping is also a Suji, and as well as a safe tile to Kamicha and Taemin. So, 2 ping would definitely be a better cut than uh, the middle tile, which is the Faisal. So definitely should be a 2 ping there. Again. And I see Kamisha Tedashi uh, a 9 ping. So I actually become very alerted by that and discard a 9 soul, which is very reasonable. The 9 8 is actually 100% safe. So maybe not even the, the pair of 2 ping, two ping but the 9 8 soul. So at this point, definitely just completely fold here. And also, sorry, actually, I, mi I, did, I did miss uh, Richie. I'm dumb. <laughs> Excuse me? Um, so, so she, yeah, she won't try to kill Richie. That's why I cut the 9. And uh, should I be cutting the 8 here? Oh, the 2 soul is also safe. Okay. So I don't cut I don't cut 8 soul. Okay. Fair enough. Let's move on. South 3. This is um, another round I want to talk about in terms of um, efficiency. So skip ahead a little. We draw one soul. So lo look at this hand here, guys. What would you think a, a po would be a, like a possible hand I can make? I was actually thinking, you know, I have so many edge tiles. Let's actually go Junchang. So I discard a fossil here, fossil here, because I still get the the Sanzo acceptance, um, the three. So. Make our way towards that. We cheat the 9-ping. The second 9-ping coming out instead of the first one. Again, we didn't want to commit that early at the beginning. When they discarded the first one. Here. But, um. 
Let's come check this card the second one that I do commit 40. And discard uh, the three man, which I can't use as a pair because of Jun Chang. 40 outside hand. And drew the another 9 ping. Here is like, okay, do I want to keep this 9 ping? To make another uh, block? Or do I have do I wanna keep the rest of these? I was actually thinking that oh okay. First of all, Manzu oh I need to stop auto playing. First of all, Manzu is easy to come out because a lot of abundance of Manzu discard on the table. So I think I can get one man. Comparatively, like souls are a little iffy. And I don't think I can necessarily get the nine soul. So I discard the seven and eight actually. Even though it's a Liang Man, because I'm going Jun Chang, it actually becomes a very uh, bad shape in my hand. So I discard them in favor of a nine ping. Also counting my blocks, I already have four blocks. So I'd rather have nine ping as a floating tile. So actually I got very lucky here. I say. I drew the eight ping, so at this point, I'm like, okay, I see two one months out there. And I have the guaranteed um Jun Chang on the side rather than the Liang Man. Again, Liang Man is not so great. So I discard the, the three man. And I actually drew into Tempire into another set of seven, eight, nine. The reason why I also didn't discard two three is because of Sanshuku on the one, two, three. So Sanshuku will give me a mangan, potentially, and overturn the position from third place to Second place, which will be great, but we're not gonna agree for that. We're just gonna take Tempai here. Again, we discard the five ping. At this point, then they can't know that I'm finished whether I finished my hand or not, based on you know I did open once, I discarded some non-middle tile or tiles pretty close to the edge. But I haven't discarded an edge tile. So they don't know if I'm Tempai, and the five ping discard certainly means that again they might be potentially Suji trapped into discarding the two ping. Let's skip ahead. No. So yeah, so Kamicha actually decided to push with Dora Palm, and I want to actually push with, with this despite the Dora Palm, simply because if I don't win this hand, chances are that two man might come back and bite me and uh, reverse the position for me to get last place. So no. we take that, we'd be happy. With uh, a Jun Chang with 40 outside hand plus Dora Horn. Fairly power hand, I say. Uh, last round. Yeah, now I'm seeing the potential to push for uh, actual second place. So I actually do go for it. Going um, to the draw here. No doubt I already have four pairs. So I was actually thinking, okay, seven pairs. So I, I, you know, I try a little bit to build a regular hand, but in the end, it's. What I decided to go with. As I draw into my fifth pair. So I have I have like some long tiles that's not on the table yet. For sure I want to be going for these hands. The consideration would be discard any tile that was like already out there. I'm a little sloppy, I say. Like for example, if I want to draw this one man here, I should be discarding the seven soul, which is out there twice, or the three three soul. And then when you're confused about which tile to go to, certainly discard, you know, actually, sorry, I already have four pairs here. That was my bad, but as you see later, as I just draw into the last seven soul, actually, I got really lucky. Now I just said to have to fully commit to the seven pairs. Yeah, my apologies. That was middle of the second row when I decided to um, commit into Chitui. Also because Kamicha at this point have Two pawns. So definitely want to be more defensive rather than doing some more offensive plays. But at the same time, I'm trying to keep my eyes open for potential. Yeah, I discard the seven, seven pin here when I draw the four soul, which is dangerous against Kamicha. Keeping some of the more, you know, shady tiles that's not out there yet. And from the looks of it, I know Kamicha is also Tui Tui. That's so that's what would be another consideration to not discard. Um, Live tiles. Okay. So again, like I drew another one here. I decided four souls look safer than a four man. Four man is a no suji against it's a half suji against uh sorry, it's a half suji against Trayman and it's half suji against Kamicha as a no suji against Shimocha versus four soul, which is blocked by the spy soul. So if anyone have discarded one soul 
So it's a complete Suji actually because of the Faisal Kabe. So definitely I saw I thought like a Forcer was safer. But consideration would be that, you know, Kami has already taken five for Toy Toy, so the format might be actually a little safer in that regard. So again, like um I'll also be reflecting on my own place and point out any mistakes I think that might have occurred. So at this stage, yeah, again, um, I have a I got into Tempai here, and I have the choice between four man and the two man. Supposedly, four man is actually safer, and also, uh, it's because yeah, sorry, because I have discarded the four man a little earlier, so four man definitely would be a slight better candidate. Again, it's a catastrophe to everybody's discard. And as you can see, guys, um, discarding the two man here because the five man is a Suji was a side of a bait no. as I deal into Kamicha. So that does conclude the game. I do have a lot to reflect on in terms of um, more detailed discards, but luckily we got this game alive despite that uh, very rough early game that we had for the first um, three rounds all the way up to um, E3. So yeah. This video is going to be a little shorter than the other ones, so hopefully you enjoy that, and um, yeah, ho hopefully uh, we will see you guys next year. Um, uh, not yet. Um, mm, next week as well. Yeah, stay tuned. See you guys around. Bye.